All right, what up, people? Welcome back to the channel. Hopping right back into some more Road to the Show. We are taking on the Houston Trash or the Houston Astros in a three-game series. And yeah, this is going to be a fun one because in the last video I said I wanted to do something since the first day I played Road to the Show, and that was change my batting stance. Now, I'm not going to tell you who we chose. I want you guys in the comment section below to try to guess who it is. It's a pretty obvious one, but tell me who this is. I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to give you any hints because I know someone is going to figure it out. And uh, yeah, let me know who you think it is. It's a really funny batting stance. It's completely wide open. Hopefully, we get a chance to bat right-handed so you guys can actually see um, like his foot and stuff. Well, I guess my face cam will be blocking it. So yeah, that's kind of annoying. But uh, here, let me just go replay real quick. That's kind of sucks. We already got out with our new batting stance, but we are already winning two nothing. Oh my God. The Royals are so freaking good. But yeah, previous play right here. Look at this batting stance, dude. How scared would you be to have to play against this guy? Are you kidding me? Like, look at this leg kick too. Look at this thing. Oh my God. What a psycho, bro. What a psycho. Yeah, I hope I never have to pitch to someone that looks as mean as him. That would really suck. But let's go back to it. Yeah, so my first at-bat with my new batting stance did not go too well. Um, yeah, it was pretty rough. And it, it's really not as weird. Oh, my God. We almost just booted that ball. But luckily, we did it because we have so much skill. But, uh, yeah, I really thought it was going to be weirder than this. Like, I chose this one because I thought, yeah, this is going to be weird AF. But, honestly, it's really not that weird. I thought it was going to be weirder. So, maybe we will even change it up um, in the next episode, maybe. I just wouldn't be known as the guy with the weirdest batting stance ever. Now, people are probably going to remember Mighty Go Jr. as, oh, my God, dude, that's brutal. Over two already. Are you kidding me? But, but yeah, he's probably going to be remembered as the greatest player ever. To ever play baseball, he's going to be known as that guy. But... I kind of want to be known as the guy with the weirdest batting stance that also hit 7,000 home runs in a career. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we are up 4 nothing or 4-1 to so the Houston Astros. I wonder how they scored that run. They probably got a camera out there and hit a trash can four times to show the knuckleball was coming. But that was a good hit, even though that was way foul. Um, I feel like we squared it up. Yeah, late and okay contact. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. My God, is it hot in my office. Bro, all of a sudden, it just gained like... 37 degrees, like instantly, bro. It's got to be at least 137 in here, at least. Maybe even 140. Dude, could you imagine playing video games in 140 degrees? That would be so bad. I mean, we're close. We're only, what, three degrees off at 137? But, dude, 140 would just be absolutely brutal. But, bro, what is going on? We're 0 for 3 with the new batting stance. I'm about to quit right now and get a new one. Because this is brutal, dude. I have not hit anything. Haven't even squared a ball up at all. If this ball isn't hit good, what in the... This is this is not good, boys. This is, like, actually horrible. Yeah. After this game, I'm quitting. I'm going to find a new batting stance because screw this one. But luckily, the Royals are absolutely dominating. It is just so nice, dude. Like, previously in Road of the Show, if I did bad, so did the team. But with the Royals, dude, anyone can do bad, and everyone else will pick them up. It is absolutely amazing. But uh, what do you know? I think that was George Springer hitting a home run. So the trash cans still have not been confiscated from the Astros. But it's a 7-2 game. I'm just glad we're winning. Um, yeah, if you guys missed the last video, we are indeed in first place right now in our division, which is clutch, but we cannot be distracted, bro. We just got to keep winning. Oh, I didn't even know someone was at third base. Maybe I should have tried to throw him out of four. I feel like he would have been safe regardless, but, uh, but yeah, we just got to keep winning, bro. We cannot be like, oh, we're in first place. It's okay if we lose. No, because I am not, not winning a world series this year. So yeah, we got to make sure we win every game possible. And dude, I'm starting to scare. I'm starting to get a little scared here. I feel like the Astros are going to have some huge late game comeback. So we just got to make sure that doesn't happen. Okay, Casey, let's go, baby. Let's go. What's the score? What's the score? Oh God, 7-3, top of the ninth. Okay, so this is the final play of the game. And yeah, before I forget to say, I said in the last video, uh, make sure you guys that are new to the channel and have it already, make sure you guys go sub to my second channel, link in the description, okay? It is pretty much exactly like this one, but I play all types of games over there. I don't play any baseball thing uh, or any baseball games. I don't do anything baseball related. That is only for this channel. But my other channel is any game you can imagine. Fortnite, Call of Duty, freaking anything. Make sure you guys Guys, go check it out link in the description go sub to it and uh, check it out okay there's not a lot of videos on there right now haven't posted in a couple months but I promise videos coming real soon but let's go hop into the next game wait no I'm gonna go change my batting stance and then come back yeah uh, one sec all right we got a new batting stance I know the first one only lasted one game and uh, yeah I want to tell you what the name is but I'm afraid that's gonna ruin it so I'm not gonna say it yet 
Make sure you guys leave your guesses below, and I will probably heart one of them that says the correct answer. But, uh, yeah, I did change my batting stance. This is completely custom made, and I'm sure it's going to look pretty stupid. So here we go. Oh, yeah. Now, it doesn't look that bad, okay? My bat is kind of glitching. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like my bat. What the? Dude, this is going to be hard to hit. Did you guys just see how, like, weird that was? Like, watch how he stands up. Look at this. How does, how does someone move that fast? That is insane. This guy is the most athletic person ever. Let me hit a ball real quick. Come on. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty distracting, dude. I cannot focus on the ball coming in. All I see is my guy standing up. Like, just watch how he quickly he stands up, dude. It's insane. But we do make contact. Is this going to bleed? No, it is not. We are now, what, 0 for 4 on the episode? That is so bad, dude. That is actually straight dog, dude. So, yeah, let me show you the batting stance real quick. It doesn't look that weird from the front, like from this angle. But when you go to the side, look at that, dude. I don't think there's a batting stance that you can get, like, your, uh, your legs spread farther apart. Like, look at this, bro. What a weirdo, dude. But look how quick he stands up. It's still so weird. Watch this. Here comes the pitch. Boom. Like, that is not, that is probably not how you should swing a bat. That just seems like a lot of wasted movement. If you're a baseball player, don't have this batting stance, okay? Don't do it. It looks horrible. But, uh, yeah, let's go keep hitting. Maybe get a hit this episode. That would be cool. All right. Well, I mean, worst case scenario, uh, let's just beat the Astros. That's really our main concern right now. We're playing good enough to be happy. Oh, you're going to go four? I dare you to go four. Yeah, you better not, dude. Look at this arm, dude. Oh, my God. Dude, absolute cannon. Oh, God. Oh, they only scored one? You're telling me the Astros only scored one with the bases loaded and no outs? Let's go, baby. But, uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, my God. This stance is so freaking weird. But, yeah, 1-1 one, one game. We got to make sure we score here. Dude, this batting stance. I don't know if I can keep rocking it, dude. Him standing up is just so freaking distracting, dude. Oh, and he hits me. Are you kidding me? Dude, we might not get a hit this episode. Dude, he's not happy. I'm just saying Mighty Goat is not happy. He doesn't like when you hit him. So uh, I, would, I would watch your mouth there, Houston. Okay? You better not hit Mighty Goat Jr. ever again. Or he will be, he will be mad. He will be punching someone. Just saying. Just saying. You guys thought you hitting that trash can? You thought you hit that trash can hard? Just wait till he hits you in the face, bro. But it's a 1-1 game, 2-1. Time to redeem yourself, Mighty. Time to redeem yourself, baby. Let's get a pitch up in the zone. Do I still have showtime? Yes, I do, I think, right? Yes, let's go. Three-run bomb. Come on. Whoa, way up. Not even close to the zone. This guy's afraid. Dude, if we get walked here, there's a very good chance we don't get a hit in back-to-back -back games, which I don't think has ever happened, dude. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ball two. Oh, my God. Don't do it, Josh James. Just give me a strike. Come on, bro. I want to hit the ball. I want to freaking hit. Come on, man. Don't walk me. Don't walk me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. No. Screw you, Altuve. Oh. Dude, how do I hit a ground ball when I'm using Showtime, dude? It's like literally coming in in slow motion. It's like if you used an aimbot in Call of Duty, and we're down by four now. Oh, my God. Yep. I think me changing my batting stance has officially ruined my career. Now, I think uh, unless a lot of weird stuff happens and we start hitting balls 700 feet in this next game, uh, I'm probably going to go back to either Derek Dietrich, who is the batting stance I was just using before I changed it, or I might try out Yoan Moncada. I really like Moncada's batting stance, so I might try that one out as well. But uh, it really just depends. Or if there's a batting stance you guys want me to try out, make sure you guys let me know. Like, I always loved using Cargo's batting stance. Uh, I don't know why I actually haven't used him in this game. Um, so if you guys want me to use him, I definitely will. But come on. Yes! We got a hit. Oh, my God. It's not a good hit. It's a weak base hit to right field. But, hey, I will take it. Can the Royals make some late game comeback? They cannot. I think we scored. But, obviously, it wasn't enough. Yeah, it was. Wait, no, we didn't even score. 5-1. Well, that sucks. Off to game three. Hopefully, this time, we can score a lot of runs and win. Okay, let's go. Not a good job from Mighty Goat so far. Only one hit this episode. Let's go hit five here. And uh, be back to normal. All right, let's go. All right, game three. This is a big one. We got to make sure we play really good. We're still rocking out with the really weird batting stance, which is kind of annoying. I really didn't think it would be that distractive, but, dudes, I can't, I can't focus on the ball. So, yeah, this is definitely, like I said, unless something really weird happens, the last time you will see me with this weird batting stance. Not a fan of it. I like simple, and I like hitting the ball far. And, unfortunately, in order to do both, um, or to hit the ball far, I need a simple batting stance. I can't be distracted with my bat swirling all over the place. I can't be distracted with my guy standing up all weird. Okay, I need an easy, breezy, beautiful 
batting stance. I think I stole, what is that company? CoverGirl. Did I just quote CoverGirl? I swear I don't read it. I, I don't think. Is that even a magazine, dude? I don't even know what CoverGirl is. Is that a makeup That's brand? Cool. Yeah. No Easy breezy, cool. beautiful CoverGirl. Yeah, that is. I was right. I don't know if I should be proud about that or not. But hey, I'm smart, okay? And we grounded out again, dude. At least we're winning. Wait, did I get an RBI out of that? I might have got an RBI. Oh, God. George Springer's up. This ball is about to be hit. Wait, pay attention, guys. You hear this? Listen for the trash can. Bang, bang. Uh-oh. Boom. Oh, he actually hit it. But unfortunately, you hit it to the wrong guy. Boom. You're gone. Sit down, George Springer. Smell you later. All right, give me another at-bat. I'm feeling good here. I'm feeling good. Nope. Uh, who's up? Miles Straw. Okay. Okay, Miles Straw. What are, the, what are you going to kill a turtle? Because your last name's Straw. Get it? Because straws kill turtles and stuff um okay weird 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 ending to this episode here boys i don't know where this is going i'm talking about turtles i'm talking about straws i'm talking about cover girl but let's go change our mind here and hit a ball over the fence you know what let's hit it over the crowd out there in center field that's got to be at least a 700 foot shot oh my god what the f was that that was really weird i tried using uh showtime but it just like turned off i don't know why that happened maybe i let go of the trigger even though i know i didn't i don't know let's go uh oh boom that's gone. That's got to be gone. Two run shot. Come on. Don't catch it. Don't catch it. Oh, yeah, that's gone. Boom. Lucky fan gets a souvenir from the goat. Beautiful job there, Mighty. That's what I'm talking about. Now we're up 3 1 or 3 nothing. Sorry. That was 400. Dang it, dude. I didn't even, I didn't even guess the distance, bro. I was 100% going to say 436. Like, I promise. I promise to all the turtles. Oh, my God. It's a 3 3 game. Frick, dude. That is not good. Oh, routine. Routine. Make to play, Mighty. Is anyone? No, no one's on base. So, or someone's on second base. I was just saying no one's in scoring position. So this throw doesn't matter. But let's see. Give me another at bat. Thank you very much. We're one for two. So what, we only have two hits this episode. Yeah, that is brutal, bro. Literally the worst episode ever hitting wise. I think there might have been a worse episode, but I doubt it. So yeah, this is this could be our final two at bats because we're definitely getting another at bat. But yeah, I just want to hit. I just want to hit another home run just so I can see. You remember that one time? I was using that really weird batting stance, and I hit two home runs. Yeah, why can't we do that again? But that's going to be a double, I think. We're going to go two. We got the speed to make it there. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. And now there's two in scoring position with two outs. Come on, baby. Whoever's a four-hole hitter, please get the job done as he doesn't. He probably struck out looking like an idiot. Oh, my God. All right, come on, pitchers. Just don't give up any. Oh, that's deep. I don't think we're making this play. Go, go, go. Jump. Oh, my God. So close. All right, well, good backup center fielder, dude. One of these days... I'm going to make the greatest play ever. You're hearing it here first. We're going to make the greatest play of all time. You thought that Willie Mays catch was amazing? Where he ran like three and a half miles, caught it, turned around and threw it? Yeah, this is going to be way better than that. Let's go. Oh, bases. Why don't I have showtime right now? God dang it, dude. Frick balls. Come on, Mighty. Focus up. I know you think you need to rely on the showtime, but you don't, dude. You're good without it. We're doing a power swing. Please, dude. One grand slam with the weirdest stance ever. Oh, that was it, dude. He just threw a curveball in my wheelhouse, dude. How do I pull down on the PCI on that one? Oh, my God. Yep, that's great, dude. How did we pop that up? Dude, I, dude, that was a perfect PCI placement for a home run. Oh, my God, dude. Hopefully, we get an RBI. Be safe. Safe. Okay, well, we get the lead. We're up 4-3 now. Hopefully, that's enough to win, dude. I cannot believe I missed that thing. I'm sorry, team. Yes. Thank God the Royals do end up winning. That was really sketchy. I cannot believe I missed that freaking Grand Slam. Dude, I'm missing a lot of Grand Slams. Like, that is not good. So many Grand Slams are being missed by the GOAT. But that is going to end the video right there. Uh, at least we finished pretty strong. Two for four. We started off not great. But, uh, yeah, again, if you guys have not subscribed to my second channel, link in the description. Go do it. More videos coming on there very soon. So stay tuned. But I'm out. I'll see you in the next one. Oh, peace.